The Pope's trip to Mexico was also the last one for Alberto Gasbari, the organizer of the papal journeys, always seen in the background during the Pope's travels outside Italy. He held the position of administrative director of Vatican Radio as well, and over 37 years, during the little free time in between, he organized the Pope's journeys abroad. Da 47 anni lui lavora in Vaticano e da 37 anni che fa i viaggi. E, ma lo dico perché possiamo durante questi giorni esprimerle la nostra gratitudine e anche pensare a una festicciolina qui nel rientro. Eh? After six intense days of work, the Pope wanted there to be this small official farewell and sharing with his traveling companions. Anche io ripeto quello che ho detto all'inizio. Grazie tante. E mi ha dato buoni consigli. Solo ha un defetto. We've shared many difficult experiences, emergency landings, countries at war, and I've never seen him annoyed, complain, upset or rude. He's truly a gentleman. A few small gifts were given to him, an Alitalia model plane, a keychain, and a collection of the best photos of him taken over the 37 years of his working on the papal journeys. You could say that once in a while, he did a photo bombing of historic moment. You would see the Pope, a president, and Alberto Gaspari. We hope he likes the gift. Of course, I thank Pope Francis for his trust and patience. And I would like to share a story. In November, we were in Africa, in Bangui, and the Holy Father had to meet with the bishops there. But I saw him going into the chapel where the bishops weren't present. So I said, Holy Father, you have a meeting with the bishops. And he answered, I'm going to the chapel to ask the Blessed Mother to give me the strength to be patient with Alberto Gasbari. Well, now I've freed him from that prayer intention. The person taking over the preparation of the papal journeys now is Colombian Monsignor Mauricio Rueda, whom the Pope presented to those traveling with him on this journey.